Hello everybody, so it's your is back. I have a match in my Zaku 1. Uh, this was requested by Gutter. His request was stating, I want you to use your favorite mobile suit and your least favorite mobile suit. And I had to ask him, do you mean lore-wise or do you mean... Or do you mean just generally in the game? And all he did was uh, kind of just respond with yes. And then proceeded to go and like, kind of give me an explanation as to... Uh, like how his favorite support is the um, heavy Gundam, and that kind of that's how he got into MSV and all that. And uh, for my favorite suit, you guys already know I have to go with my boy's the Zaku one. So here I'm using the uh, support version. He plays like a fucking general, and he's really good at it. Um, if you give him the bazooka. You have access to two stunning weapons in the form of the Bazooka and the Sternfaust. And both of these will hit for well above uh, 2,000 damage. Almost 3k to most targets. The uh, Sternfaust, uh, as you guys know, is single shot but does a crap ton of damage with a decent AoE to it. Uh, and, of, uh, and of course it uses the Zaka Bazooka. Uh, the axe on this suit is really gross as on a downswing you will hit most generals for again above 2500 this thing is is Really good at dishing out the damage 1800 uh, even though I hit the, uh, the High gogs uh, shoulders because those high gog shoulders they have uh, buffers on them. So I Instantly do less damage when I hit them so this this suit is probably one of my favorite to go to uh, low cost supports just because it can do at that much uh, that amount of damage. I got Viz with me. He's in one of the Rams of Um I'm kind of surprised we did as well in this match as we did, considering we have no generals. We have three raids and two supports, and it actually worked really well. But uh. Yeah, I just had to go with my boy, the Zaka one, for my favorite mobile suit. Uh, it was my very first mobile suit I've ever seen. Uh, my very first scene I've ever seen in Gundam was the, uh, where the Zaka one bo uh, bodied the fucking, uh, oh, what was it? I can't remember where he shoulder rammed, uh, I can't remember. My brain's not functioning. But then he immediately got, you know destroyed after it like but I, I I could not not enjoy that scene because it's just like Char was like hey that suits like fucking ancient what what are you doing and Gatum is just like hey guess what I don't give a fuck I'm gonna show you how the real man does it and damn he got in and he was able to do what he wanted to do I mean yeah he died shortly after but like that was cool and I just and to me the Zaka one just spoke to me and uh, I couldn't, I could not, not like the suit. And then uh, give it a few, uh, give it about five years later, or not five years later, but a, a little bit later. My friend, uh, friend's brother, lets me borrow his copy of uh, Federation versus uh, Federation versus Zeon. And uh, that was my introduction into gun video games, right? And wow, that that pro got fucked. Um, that was my introduction to uh, kind of video games, and the first thing I picked out was the Zaku one, and I used that until I got the level three, and that's when it got the Commander horn. I'm like, yeah, this suits for me, uh, because it looks so good with the Commander horn. I, I, that's not even a joke. It looks so good with the Commander horn, and uh, it looks. It looks just like my suit. Like, that's not even a joke. I just fell in love. Um, I wasn't even mad. It just looked good. So, uh, this is definitely a suit that I have always enjoyed. Always enjoyed the look at it and how simplistic it looks for a Xenon mobile suit. Um, I'm hoping we get, like, the Zaku, Zaku 1Q type. Uh, there's, I wish there was a skin we could put on the Zaku tank that would give it the Zaku torso, to be honest. Zaku 1 torso. 
an Azaku 1 head because there are images of some of the Azaku tanks having the Azaku 1. So, yeah, I just, I've always, this is just a suit that I've always enjoyed. It has never failed to put a smile on my face. You got, there's one Azaku 1 in the, uh, the unicorn manga, and I can't remember who, uh, what ace pilot it, pilots it, but it's a heavily modified Zaku one, and it's, uh, I can't remember if it actually uses the Gelgug rifles that it's mounted all over its body, because, uh, I don't remember the stats on it, but I don't think they put an auxiliary generator on that Zaku to run those, uh, beam rifles, but it's got, like, four Gelgug beam rifles mounted on its shoulders, and it's, like, carrying six stern files, like, this is a workhorse like, uh, this old war dog is just here, and it's it's going to do its job. One of my favorite scenes in MS Igloo was, uh, the Zaku one was hiding by this rocky outcove on this, uh, uh, on a, a bow coup, and here comes fucking two Jim Kites landing on the ground. One's like, oh yeah, I made it first, you owe me a drink, and here comes the Zaku one behind this rock with its 105 turns to them and hoses both of them at the same time. Favorite fucking scene right there. I'm like, that's my boy. That's my Zaku one doing some work. And, uh, I've, I don't know. It's just something about the Zaku one that I just love. And, uh, it just always puts a smile on my face. He did, oh yeah. And Gutter didn't really give me any specifications on the coloration. I just went with the Zaku, uh, Zaku one real, uh, real type battle colors, uh, on my, uh, on this one, and it turned out just fine. But yeah, a hundred percent favorite mobile suit right here. Um, it just puts a smile on my face. It really does. Uh, I can't tell you how my, uh, customized Zaku one would look because I've. It always changes the head. Damn. My sleep medication because uh, all my medication got upped, right? And they're much higher. And the sleep medication is still screwing with me. And also my uh, Zoloft apparently can cause drowsiness too. So that's that's probably not helping. But yeah, no, like, uh, my, my idea for, like, my custom Zaka one always changes. It never fails to uh, get changed up in some way. Right now, my basic idea is to just have a Zaku 1 with the, uh, uh, Zaku, or the Goof Custom Shield, the Heat Sword mounted in that, a, uh, Rikate and Bazooka, and a MMP-80, and that's pretty much what I would use at this moment. But, uh, it always changes. Like, last year, I want, I wanted a, uh, heavy support one where it was running a, uh, handheld minigun like the Don Barrage, but it was modified to be held in both hands instead of under, uh, under slot on, uh, my right arm. But yeah, Gutter, I hope you enjoyed your video. Um, I love my Zaka ones. Oh, I love them. I got fucking hiccups. But, um, yeah, Gutter, thanks for becoming a patron, too. That, you're a good guy. Let's take a look at the patrons. We have Brennan Markey, Azrael Casey, Cybaster, Dragon Spark, 90, Gunnam Nuggers, Jeff Dunn, Clav, Maverick, Momoka, Ninja Guy 12, Peter Strike, Tyler Spud, OD7, Chisels, uh, fuck you, uh, Trailos, Alamo, Steel Talon, Bad Logic, Vinci Robo, Yo Boy, Burrito, Bird Person, Mysteries, Mercenary, Will Stab, Talamaze, Phantom, OC, Viscarian, Xena, Ghost, Michael, Bryson, Wolf Lord, Bane, Beer, Dangerously, Crusader, Raven, Blackbird, Chris, and Serena, Dra uh, Serena Dragon, and Gutter. I want to thank you guys for supporting me. It means a lot, and we shall talk to you guys later.